Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, pag-aaralan natin ang theorems on seconds and tangents. Like Find the length of the unknown segment or yung x in each given figures. So we have here circle O. And as we can see, line AC is perpendicular to line BD at E. Okay, so line AE or line segment AE is equal to 6 cm. And line segment EC is equal to 4 cm. And line segment BE is equal to X. And line segment D is equal to 8 cm. So hanapin natin yung value ng X. So dahil perpendicular tong dalawang line na to, so we can say na line segment AE over line segment EC or CE is equal to line segment BE over line segment ED. So, ano ulit yung length ng AE? That is 6 cm. Over EC is 4. And it's equal to BE, that is X. And ED is 8. Okay, kapag ganyan, so gagawin lang natin is cross multiply. So, 4 times X, that is 4X. Equal to 6 times 8, that is 48. Dahil ang hahanapin natin ay ang value ng x. Pero yung x ay may kasama pang 4. So divide natin both sides into 4. So that is cancel kasi 4 divided by 4 is 1. So matitira na lang dito sa left side is x. And 48 divided by 4 is equal to 12. So, x is equal to 12. Next, we have here circle M. At meron siya yung dalawang second. Ano yung dalawang second na yun? It's line AC and line CE. And line CB is equal to x. And uh, line AC is equal to 20. Then, line CD is equal to 6. And line CE is equal and line D is equal to 9. So, paano natin hahanapin yung value ng x? So, dahil ng dalawang line na to is also uh, perpendicular. Perpendicular sila sa C. Line CA over line CD then line CA and line CD is equal to to line CE over line CB. Okay, so ano yung ulit value ng line CA? Line segment CA? That is 20. 20 over line CD is 6. And it is equal to line CE buong line, so 6 sa kanayin yun. So pag adin lang natin, 6 plus 9. Then line CB, so yun yung X. Then simplify natin, so that is 20 over 6 is equal to 6 plus 9, that is 15 over X. Now I cross multiplication, so 20 times X, that is 20X equal to 6 times 15. And 6 times 15, that is 90. Okay, dahil may kasama pa yung x, so divide natin both sides into 20. So, cancel na lang kasi 20 divided by 20, that is 1. So, x is equal to 90 divided by 20, that is 4. 0.5. So x is equal to 4.5. Next we have here circle C. At meron siyang 
second at tangent. So, tangent natin is line AB, which is equal to X. And yung second is line BE. And e, line ED is equal to 4, and line DB or BD is equal to 6. Also, find the value of X. So, dahil perpendicular din sila. So, that is line BE, one segment BE, yung second over the tangent, which is line AB, line segment AB. is equal to the tangent line segment AB divided by line BD, line segment BD. Okay, so anong value ng line BE? So pag adin mo lang yung line BD at line DE which is 6 plus 4, and 6 plus 4 is equal to 10. And line AB, that is X, and that is equal to line AB, that is X, and line BD, that is 6. Okay, so cross multiplication. So X times X, that is X raised to 2. 10 times 6, that is 60. Okay, dahil may square yun, so square root natin. And yung square root ng x raised to 2, that is x. So x is equal to square root of 60. Since hindi perfect square ang 60, so hatiin natin sa dalawa. So we can say that 15 times 4 is equal to 60. So the square root of 60 is equal to the square root of 15 times 4. So, x is equal to square root ng 15 ay hindi rin perfect square. Pero yung square root ng 4 is 2. So, that is 2 square root of 15. Or, x is equal to, kapag gagawin mo yung decimal, that is 7.75. So ito ang video natin para sa araw na ito at sana nag-enjoy kayo at may bago kayo natutunan. At huwag kakalimutang mag-like, mag-share at mag-subscribe at pindutin na rin ang notification bell para updated kayo sa mga bagong video.